Hey friends, this is Renee from Little Village Homestead and today I'm going to show you a quick and easy potato and ham casserole with pantry stock. Be right back! going to show you how I make a quick casserole using mostly my pantry stock. My dehydrated potatoes and my dehydrated onions and oh yeah remember when I said my last big Meyer haul yeah. that I, I'll buy these when they're 10 for 10 for a quick meal. Well this is one of those quick meals. So first off I got my nice pan here and I sprayed it with my cooking spray. I've got four cups of my dried potatoes, my dehydrated potatoes. I'm going to put them in there. And then sporadically on top of that, i got about two tablespoons of butter. I'm just going to dot, you know, here, there, and everywhere. Get those laid around there. Okay. And the next thing, oh, I can put a little bit of my onions in there. Oh my gosh, do those smell wonderful. Those are my dehydrated onions. Now you can put veggies, you can put anything you want, but this is just a quick, quick casserole I'm doing for my family for dinner. Okay, so that's that's good. I'm going to leave that sitting there. We're going to move this camera back so you can see my pan. Now, with this pan, I'm going to put two cups of water and... Two cups of milk. And there's my two cups of milk. I'm going to turn that on. Put that in the sink. Then I'll be right back up with my milk away. Okay, now I'm going to take and do my... Uh, Put my soup in here, my soup from my can. I'm using cream of chicken. You could use, I would rather use cream of mushroom, but my husband hates it. So I'm using cream of chicken, but you can pretty much use any cream soup you want. Okay? But now we're going to take a whisk. We're going to whisk this up a little bit, break it up, because we're going to heat this till it just about boils. I want it nice and hot to go over our potatoes. I also have some ham that I'm going to put in my potatoes. Okay, now I'm going to crack a little bit of salt in here, or salt, pepper. I'm going to do a little bit of pepper. I'm not adding salt to this because two reasons. The uh, potatoes, or excuse me, the... Um, the soup is salty itself, and then the ham has got salt in it. So I don't need all that extra salt. So while that's heating up, I'm just going to take my ham chunks and just put it in here. All right, and that's ready to go. Just got to wait for this to heat up, and we'll be good. I'll be back when this is all heated up, and I'm going to go grab some parsley and put in here, too. So I'll be back. Okay, this is all hot, hot. So we're going to start pouring it right into these potatoes. And of course, I made a mess. There. So... That's that quick and that easy. Fast, easy. That's what I like. Anyway, these are going to bake in my oven. I got it set for 400. They're going to bake in the oven for about, oh, 35, 40 minutes. And then um, when it's done, I'll be back and I'll show you. 
Okay, friends, I'm back and our casserole is done. And look at how that is. That is absolutely wonderful. Now I'm just going to let it sit and rest here for about 10 minutes or so and let it finish soaking up all the moisture in it and it will be good. And I'll show you how it looks on the plate. <music> 